Hey guys, Rich here with Brotherhood Reviews and we're back doing a chapter review of One Piece 1063 and this chapter has a lot going on and it is not a very long chapter for us so with this breakdown I'm not going to take too long with it but don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. My videos have been getting a lot of friction but I hope you guys enjoy the videos i'm bringing you and i hope to bring you guys more but without further ado uh let's start off with the cover page the cover page it is uh chocolate town and pudding has been kidnapped and everybody's turned to ice you see uh cracker and brute in the background completely frozen to ice um Anyways, uh, chapter, the first page, we see, uh, Bonnie, Luffy, and Chopper, they are full, they are filled up, they can't eat anymore, Atlas, uh, pretty much tells them, like, you guys eat, ate a lot, your bellies are rounder than before, Jinbei says, my belly's always been around, it's a hilarious moment, um, but, Atlas uh, at last has to go and does uh, run riots, I guess, whatever that means. Um, and they are left there to just be there. Now, a recycling dog comes and chews up all the remaining bones and garbage left over from them uh, using the food machine. And they're like, they're like, that's cool. And they see, um, more and more people around now that atlas came and pretty much confronted them uh they they were talking about whether or not these people were actually there the whole time or if atlas um or if atlas brought uh or if atlas was like checked out and now that they know they're okay um luffy got clothes out of this store I guess you could call it it's it's kind of like the food machine you just pick whatever outfit you want and it magically poops on you and Luffy got this like winter gear but it's nice and breezy he says it's lightweight it doesn't you know it doesn't it, it allows him to breathe but it looks like winter garments Bonnie is like yeah you got to be hot in that and she tries she does it for herself she gets a battle arm a battle suit i guess um and she says the boots make her feel like she's floating on air chopper gets uh the, pretty much the same one as luffy um and jimbei sits there in a hawaiian t-shirt it is amazing <laughs> you know he's just all casual and he says it so he's like i could change myself <laughs> It's, it's too funny like because each of them just pooped and he's like nah i got this i don't need i don't need no magical machine to change my clothes and now a kuma police officer cyphering comes up and starts attacking them calling them thieves and you know they don't understand what's going on they're like oh like this stuff wasn't free like there was no way of them knowing that they had to pay for it so the kuma siphon starts attacking them and this is where the title comes in don't hurt him he is my father he he is the only family i got so bonnie is trying to convince luffy not to attack kuma when a two oh, a kuma when kuma is attacking him um and you know they they try and put it in perspective like that is not your father like that is a cypher he is a full cyborg he just looks like your dad but um at last she's crying and then he shoots a beam and it cuts to blackbeard and law and this is actually crazy um so doc q injects hits them with this disease that makes them change genders uh laws of female i was wondering what was going on with that um laws of female a lot of the crewmates are changing genders and law saying they're just trying to do that to disorient us and he says i i can 
I can, uh, I can change, you know, I can change back into a human, oh, no, into a human, I can change back into a male by using my hockey, so he does, their submarine is being badly in, uh, damaged, so he, ha they have to surface, it, it's a, it's a crazy battle right now, but as they surface, they get confronted by none other than the rest of the Blackbeard pirates, now, um, we have, Doc Q, Van Auger, Jesus Burgess, um, Stronger, and obviously their captain, uh, Blackbeard, all show up. Burgess has the buff buff fruit now. Um, you know, Van Auger has the white white fruit. Doc Q has the sick sick fruit. And uh, Stronger has the horse horse fruit. Uh, mythical zone horse horse fruit model uh pegasus now if i'm not mistaken wasn't that the the devil fruit that uh that the bird had in skypea like somebody let me know in the comments if you made it this far let me know in the comments if that's not the same fruit that the bird had in skypea but um anyways now blackbeard and law are going back and forth he's like i knew one of you guys after defeating kaido and big mom were going to come to my island it was inevitable one of you guys were going to come here who it was i didn't know but i know you have i know you've been out here stealing these etchings and i need the ones you got and law gangster he said straight up you know you know i want the one you got you know blackbeard has the last load pony to live mind blown mind blown savage <laughs> like as randy troy would say savage you know that is nuts that's next level information but and that is the end of the chapter and it's when titans clash um law says you know what let's do this winner takes all and but law even said it but he was like these guys have some monstrous devil fruits they were out here getting some crazy devil fruits this is nuts but can't wait for the next chapter doesn't say anything about a break so there's probably no break next week i hope you guys have a good daytime night whenever you guys are listening to this thank you